Batman Kevo. Batman Kevo. Batman Kevo. I've been hearing Batman Kevo name for the last, like, I want to say three weeks or four weeks or so. Now I'm lying. It's longer than that. But he was talking about some stuff on his YouTube. So he offered up. He said he's doing the OnlyFans for $50. I said, all right, man, I'm going to check it out for $50. My expectations for his OnlyFans was going to be that he cat. He is an ex-scammer. You know what I'm saying? So I'm thinking he's probably still scamming. Is, you know, you got 10,000 people. If they come, spend $50. It's 500 k Okay, you know, the, the next month, he'll probably make another 10,000 subscribers, and, and, and that's another part, okay? He just probably scamming again. To my surprise, it's worth the $50. So you guys know it's no cap. I spent the money. Batman Kevo, with only fans. As you can see, Batman Kevo giving out information. I mean, I spent literally the whole entire day watching video, watching video. So, obviously, I'm gonna break everything down to you what his OnlyFans is offering is social media juice. If you're trying to get your social media right, he has situations in there where he's talking about business credit and personal credit, stuff like that. I will give out that was on his OnlyFans, and I hope he doesn't get mad at me about this, is that he basically broke down how when you apply for credit, based off where you live at, will show how much the limit that they'll give you and stuff like that. Like whether or not they'll trust you or they'll give you the money or how much they'll give you, I never knew that. When he said it, it made so much sense. Like the address that you're putting on file gonna kind of be able to dictate whether or not you get something. I don't know if he put it out on YouTube. I will give that out. I won't give out all his sauce and secrets and stuff like that. It's no disrespect to that guy. You know what I mean? I understand he got a business and he trying to make some money, but at the end of the day, yeah, he was giving out, he was giving out so much salt. They're gonna shut that man down. The only reason I said they're gonna shut him down is for the simple fact that at some point, they're gonna come to him and say, look, you're gonna have to stop. I don't know, I'm not saying I know anything, but it's not meant for everybody to know this information. Uh, I know about business credit. Um, this is what I'm thinking going into his OnlyFans. Is I already know these things. But then he started talking about stuff that I did not know. None of that shit he was talking about. I was like, damn, I ain't know that. You could do that? You sure? Um, his YouTube is good enough. But his OnlyFans is probably on crap. On meth. I say on meth. Period. I'm drinking some rosé, by the way. Understand, you're going to have to have money. Not necessarily so much a lot of money. It does take some money for you to have to get the ball rolling. One of the things that I did also notice that he's offering is the FaceTime one-on-ones where you can FaceTime him. Um, he shows on his OnlyFans. He's talking to people on FaceTime. Like, he'll have them or whatnot, and he'll be like, yeah, basically giving them a, like, you know, he's not gonna, he's giving them slightly their situation so he's talking about like you know hey well you know you need to do this you need to do that and he's all on the phone or whatnot and which is pretty good because it also shows that he does really connect with people that was a plus in my book because uh, I'm, I'm gonna pay the money to go ahead and FaceTime him so I'm gonna do the next video on that and tell you exactly how that went to like how that went um, was it worth it was it not like, I'm serious, his OnlyFans is worth it. His OnlyFans is not worth it to the person that says, like, I'm trying to get my credit right or business right, and they bullshit. It's not for you. Like, I say this with the most real intentions on warning people. Like, um, this is just a review. This is just my opinion. Like, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm Ayo Marley. This was my review. No biases, just the straight facts. No cap.